Hi, my name is Gabe Jacobs. I'm from New York City. And today we're going to be learning a song by Vampire Weekend called Cape Cod Quasa Quasa. Enjoy. So this song can be broken up into basically three parts. First part goes like this. Second part goes like this. And then the third part kind of brings the whole song back into the beginning and creates a loop and goes like this. Okay, so how do you play this song? It starts out with your middle finger on the third fret of the A string and your pointer on the second fret of the E string. And you strum that down once and then back up. So my strumming looks like this. Okay, the next part you put your pinky on the fifth fret of the E string and your pointer on the second fret of the A string. And then once again, you uh, strum that down and then up again. So it sounds like this. And the third part, I mean, sorry, the third chord that you're going to use here, uh, you put your middle finger on the third fret of the E string and your point jar also on the third fret of the A string. And you strum that down once. So those three chords sound like this. Now the next part is a little bit tricky. What you're going to do is a hammer-on pull-off on the E string of the second fret. So it sounds like this. How you do that is you play an open E string, you hammer on on the second fret, and then you pull off. So, and directly after that, you're gonna play the A string on the third fret with your ring finger. So it sounds like this. Sorry. So it sounds like this. Okay, now right after that, you're going to play an open A and an open G. Then, you put your middle and your pointer on the second fret of those strings. And then you move your, your middle finger to the third fret, and you play that chord. So all together, the first part sounds like this. Okay. So hopefully you got that. Uh, the next part's much simpler. Uh, what you're going to do is you're going to play the same chords that you did at the end of the first part, which was this, open A and open G. Then you're going to put your two fingers down the second fret, and move your middle finger to the right one. So you play this. And then, you just slow that down. So again, the second part is just like this. Alright, now the third part uh, kind of brings the whole thing back to the beginning and goes like this. You put your pointer on the 7th fret of the E string, your middle on the 8th fret of the A string, and your ring finger on the ninth fret of the uh, G string. And you play all those notes. And then you do it again. So. And then you just move all that, that whole chord up two frets. And you play that. And you play it again. So the third part goes like this. It's played a little bit faster, but so hopefully you can do it. It plays like, a little bit faster, it goes like this. Sorry. So that's how it goes. So uh, I'll play the whole song, and hopefully you can uh, play along with me. So here it goes. And so on. So I hope you got that and uh, if you have any questions just don't uh, feel free to ask. Goodbye.